Hey guys, Casey here. Uh, this is just a quick video to show how to get Phoenix booted up onto a G5. So um, I have my USB disk right here with Phoenix copied onto it. I have my G5 right here and I have my very professional camera rig set up. So let's get started. All right, so here's the G5 and I'm just plugging the Phoenix disk in right there. Get it powered up. And then since I have a Windows keyboard, I'm pressing um, the Windows key Alt O F. If you have a Mac keyboard, you would press Command Option O F to boot into open firmware. Here we have the open firmware screen. The first thing that we're going to type in is deb space slash space ls. This is going to give us a list of the open firmware hardware IDs. Um, you press space to scroll through the list. Um, but what we're looking for here is um, first for the USB section. So you can see that starts right here, uh, USB at B. You can see the keyboard and the mouse are there. And then USB at B comma one has disc at two under it. Um, I know that I don't have any other um, USB discs plugged in to this system. So I know that this is the Phoenix disc. So this is saying that um, this is the USB port, um, USB at B comma one. And then this is the disc, uh, disc at two. Those are the hard, uh, open firmware hardware IDs for the, the port and the disk. So I'm going to go ahead and write this down. Um, we have USB at B comma one and disk at two. So then uh, the next thing that we are going to type in is dev alias. And this is going to give us a list of um, aliases for those um, hardware IDs. So again, we're going to look uh, through this list uh, in the left column for the USB section. So that starts right there. And then remember the hardware ID we're looking for is B comma one. So then back to the list, USB section, we're looking in the second column for the first line ending in B comma one. And this tells us that the alias is USB three. So I'm gonna write that down. Now, how the boot command is going to work is um, we have the word boot, and then we have the um, alias to the USB port. So that's USB 3 um, forward slash, and then the hardware ID of the disk. So disk at two, and then we have a colon two uh, because the bootloader is always on the second partition of the disk um, for, for G5s anyway. And then comma, backslash, backslash, and the name of our bootloader is Yaboot. So again, we have boot, USB three forward slash disk at two colon two comma backslash backslash Yaboot. And so um, open firmware should hand over uh, the system to Yaboot and Yaboot should um, load Linux and then uh, load us into the 
um, Phoenix desktop. the Phoenix login screen. All right, and then now what I've done is I have moved the Phoenix disk into a different USB port because um, I want to show you the boot command um, with some different variables uh, because we'll have like different hardware IDs. Um, so again, uh, boot into um, open firmware. and type in dev space slash space ls space to scroll and then once the list populates here uh, we will again look for the usb section so here we have usb at b and here's the keyboard and Okay, so now we have um, disk at two is showing up under USB at B. Um, it's because again, I've moved the um, disk into a different port. So now we have the USB port um, hardware ID as USB at B and the disk ID is disk at two. So I'm going to go ahead and write those down. And then um, type in DEV alias. And uh, if you remember, so what we're going to do is we will look for the hardware ID. Um, look through for the USB section in the first column. And then the second column, we will stop at the first um, entry to end with the hardware ID at B. So this time uh, the alias is USB 2. So. The boot command is going to be boot USB 2 um, slash Disk at two, colon two, comma, backslash, backslash, that boot. So just slightly different than uh, it was last time. And open firmware should hand over um, system control to Yaboot. Yaboot should load the Linux kernel and uh, then into Phoenix. All right, um, hopefully this has been um, educational <laughs> and um, hopefully it, it helps you get booted into Phoenix. Um, if it did help, please let me know. If it did not, please let me know. Um, but hopefully this, um, this worked for all of you. All right, thanks guys.